Welcome to Park and Post. We've all been there waiting in line at TSA security, frustrated and stressed. But did you know that there are common mistakes that people make that can make the experience even worse? Today, we'll be sharing with you the 15 mistakes that you need to avoid at TSA lines at all costs to have a smoother and less stressful travel experience. 1. Not arriving at the airport early enough. One of the most common mistakes to avoid at the TSA line is not arriving at the airport early enough. If you arrive at the TSA line late, you may miss your flight or have to rush through security, which can be stressful and may cause you to forget important items. I have personally experienced this when I underestimated the traffic on the way to the airport and arrived at the TSA line with only 45 minutes until my flight. The TSA line was long and slow moving, causing me to miss my flight and having to pay a hefty fee to reschedule. Since then, I always make sure to arrive at the airport at least two hours before my flight to allow for any unforeseen delays. 2. Bringing prohibited items. Another mistake to avoid at the TSA line is bringing prohibited items. It's essential to familiarize yourself with the TSA's guidelines and prohibited items list before packing to avoid any issues at security. I once saw a traveler in front of me who had packed a bottle of water in their carry-on bag, which was against TSA guidelines. The water bottle was confiscated, causing a delay in the screening process and frustration for the traveler. This experience taught me to double-check the TSA's list of prohibited items before packing and to pack any liquids in accordance with their guidelines to avoid any unnecessary hassles. 3. Not preparing for security screening Preparing for security screening is crucial to avoid delays at the TSA line. This includes removing all electronics and liquids from your bag, removing shoes and belts before going through the metal detector, and preparing to comply with TSA officers' instructions. I always make sure to remove all electronics and liquids from my bag before entering the line and have my shoes and belts already off to avoid any holdups. 4. Wearing clothing or accessories that may set off the metal detector. Wearing clothing or accessories that may set off the metal detector is another mistake to avoid at the TSA line. This includes items such as jewelry, belts, and shoes with metal buckles. To avoid causing a delay in the screening process, Always wear clothing and accessories that are easy to remove and that do not contain metal to prevent any unnecessary holdups. 5. Being uncooperative with TSA officers. Being uncooperative with TSA officers can result in delays and frustration for everyone involved. To avoid any unnecessary issues, it's crucial to cooperate with TSA officers and follow their instructions during the screening process. 6. Not removing shoes or belts before going through the metal detector. Not removing shoes or belts before going through the metal detector is another common mistake to avoid at the TSA line. Shoes and belts with metal parts can set off the metal detector, causing a delay in the screening process. I once saw a traveler who was wearing cowboy boots with metal tips and was stopped by TSA officers. The traveler had to remove the boots and go through the metal detector again, causing a delay in the screening process. 7. Not packing liquids according to TSA guidelines. Packing liquids incorrectly can result in having them confiscated and potentially missing your flight. It's crucial to pack liquids according to the TSA's guidelines, which include placing them in a clear plastic bag and limiting the amount of liquid per container. 8. Bringing oversized items as carry-on. Bringing oversized items as carry-on can cause issues at the TSA line, as they may not fit in the screening machine or may exceed the carry-on size limit. Some travelers might not be aware that bringing an oversized suitcase as their carry-on can cause a backup in the screening process. If you have an oversized item as carry-on, you may have to remove the items from your bag and check the suitcase, resulting in additional fees and missed flights. To avoid any issues, it's essential to ensure your carry-on bag is within the size limit and can fit in the screening machine before entering the TSA line. Please subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay up to date with the latest airline and hotel discounts. Don't miss out. They go fast. 9. Not having necessary documentation. Not having necessary documentation, such as a valid passport or ID, can result in not being allowed to enter the TSA line or board your flight. To avoid this, it's essential to double-check the necessary documentation requirements before arriving at the airport and to ensure you have all necessary documentation with you. 10. Not following the 311 rule. 
The 311 rule is a TSA guideline that limits the amount of liquids allowed in carry on bags. Each passenger is allowed to bring a quart sized bag of liquids, aerosols, gels, creams, and pastes in their carry on bag, with each container being no larger than 3.4 ounces. Not following the 311 rule can result in having your liquids confiscated and delays at the TSA line. 11. Not having electronic devices charged. Not having electronic devices charged can cause issues at the TSA line, as they may not be able to be turned on for inspection. To avoid this, I always make sure my electronic devices are fully charged before entering the TSA line. 12. Being rude to other passengers or TSA officers. Being rude to other passengers or TSA officers can cause a stressful and unpleasant experience for everyone involved. It is absolutely unacceptable for any traveler to shout and be rude to other passengers and TSA officers, causing a disruption in the TSA line. This behavior can result in missed flights or even being removed from the airport. To avoid any issues, it's crucial to be respectful and patient with others during the screening process. 13. Carrying Sharp Objects Carrying sharp objects in your carry-on bag, such as scissors, knives, or razors, can result in having them confiscated and delayed at the TSA line. It's essential to pack sharp objects in your checked luggage or leave them at home to avoid your stuff being confiscated. You might also have to go through additional screening, causing a delay and frustration for you and other passengers. 14. Not removing prohibited items. Prohibited items such as weapons or explosives are not allowed in carry-on bags and can result in serious consequences, including arrest and fines. TSA officers will discover stun guns and other weapons during the screening process, resulting in you being arrested and facing legal consequences. To avoid any issues, it's essential to double-check the TSA's list of prohibited items and ensure you are not carrying any of them in your carry-on bag. 15. Not following TSA guidelines for special needs. Travelers with special needs, including disabilities or medical conditions, may require special accommodations during the TSA screening process. Not following the TSA guidelines for special needs can result in a stressful and unpleasant experience for the traveler. If you have a medical condition, you need to be aware of the TSA's guidelines based on your individual condition. One experience I had that taught me the importance of arriving early was when I arrived at the TSA line only an hour before my flight. I was confident I had enough time, but the line was longer than I anticipated, and there were only a few security lanes open. I ended up missing my flight, which was a costly mistake that I never want to repeat. Since then, I make sure to arrive at the airport at least two hours before my flight, especially during peak travel times. Another experience that taught me to follow TSA guidelines was when a family in front of me was stopped because they had packed a full-size bottle of shampoo in their carry-on bag. The bottle was well over the 3.4-ounce limit for liquids, causing a delay in the screening process. Seeing this made me double-check my own liquids to ensure they were packed correctly and within the guidelines. It's always better to be safe than sorry and avoid any potential delays or issues at the TSA line. Are you still looking for a great deal on flights and hotels? Don't miss out. Check out the link below for more info and to get a special discount. It's an amazing offer.